Is there a way to tell how much you're going to get paid per, per view? Or it's pretty much like they decide? No, you, it keep going up. Like when you first start out, you start at two dollars. Mm -hmm. Two dollars, a dollar, a dollar and a dollar and five cent probably, mm -hmm. or eighty cent. And then you, as you keep going and your shit, you know, getting monetized and shit like that, bro, you climb. But I'm I'm saying um, the highest the highest I ever got for a video on the live mm -hmm. was thirty seven dollars, thirty seven thirty seven dollars every thousand views, and that was on the live. That's what it was. Uh. I think FBG Cash. I got like 50k on that month. That month was like, yeah, 30 some dollars uh, uh, every thousand views, and that bitch went crazy. A humble soul. We checking back in, man. Another exclusive. You know what I'm saying? We got trenches news in front of the camera once again. Um, 100k plus later. You know what I'm saying? What's for going sure, on with you, bro? Sure. Man, just chilling, man. Just chilling, counting my blessings. Um, just chilling right now. So how everything going, man? How has the YouTube world changed for you, and just business and all of that, man? Since reaching that hundred thousand subscribers, man, that's that was one goal. Like, what's what's the next goal on your list and all of that, dog? Oh man, I, I ain't gonna even lie to you, bro. I'm finna go to school for real estate and shit like that, bro. Like, I'm trying to um, I'm trying to do something different, bro. Like. YouTube, you know, it, it it's so easy. I don't see why people be fighting over it, bro. It's so easy, bro. All it is is a copy replace, but they don't understand that. They too busy trying to be real niggas. And, and got the most ranking authority and all that goof ass shit. When all you got to do is copy and paste, nigga. Hey, but, um, yeah, I'm trying to do something else, man. Like, you know, I want to get into small, small home, container homes, like small one-bedroom homes, and put them, you know, throughout places. You know, a person, a person, and then, you know, you invite, like, the people like the homeless to, you know, get them type of grants. Mm -hmm. You have the people who come from the joint, you know, who ain't got nowhere, who, you know what I'm talking about, need the, need the, um, need a second chance, bro. Mm -hmm. Like a real second chance, you hear me? Like, and if you can go through the state and get a grant, you know, let them in, shit like that, though. Man, so what made you want to like take that route? Has anybody in your family pursued real estate prior to you making this decision, or what? You just just something else just to try out? No, nah, yeah, just to try. I'm, I'll be bored, bro. I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. I'll be bored. Mm. I'll be bored. YouTube easy, bro. Like it's easy. I got a million stories to tell. I can always tell them, bro. What's the key to cracking for for like a new YouTuber? <clears throat> I mean, just on the outside looking in, bro. It's like. You coming from a hot area. You got a lot of stories, man, from Chicago. Do you feel like the response would be the same if you was coming from, like, Jacksonville, Florida? Do you, or do you feel like you got a cheat code to a certain extent, man? Oh, yeah, I got a cheat code. Because, like I said, though, people can't people can't say, like, ain't no, don't nobody, no vine or no duck. Like, like been around them, no. Not just you seeing them here and here, you heard his name. Like being around them, T. Roy and them. Like I've been around them way before the drill scene and everything, bro. Like I've been around them. I ain't. This ain't just no. Oh, he jumped on the drill scene with them. Nah, bro. I know they whole families on everything, bro. That's different between me and all the other bloggers and all the other motherfuckers on the internet. Cause I really know they families. Man, so so uh, I guess this what I was getting at. <clears throat> like. Well, I guess let me ask you this, man. For somebody tuning in who just jumped into the YouTube world or is already doing their thing, but they haven't made it to like the 50, 75, 100K subscribers, on and on and on, like what's some advice you would drop on them, bro? Oh, keep pushing. Keep pushing. Um, stay consistent with content. Um, you always remember algorithm. Always remember that. Like you can't push it in that ain't in the algorithm. You hear me? What you like, mean? Like example. Like like example, if Twenty One Savage, Young Thug, and somebody else is hot, you just can't go and put Ben and Jerry did this and think that shit gonna go up. No, you gotta you gotta stick to that twenty one you know, then the algorithm. It's on fight. Mm -hmm. Other than that, your channel gonna boop. I ain't gonna be shit. Do, do you get discouraged, man? Well, that's that's one. Before I even ask you this, man, do you? Um, so that's one point. So paying attention to the algorithm, staying consistent, just constantly putting content out there. 
like what about like bruh when they do put the videos out there and it may be like with the buzzing words the buzzing titles but it still doesn't do x amount of views man like how do you stay resilient bro how did you stay resilient on the come up man and keep pushing oh when they do that you just gotta keep dropping some gonna catch some gonna catch that's what that come with consistency it could be a video that do oh this only did 100 but if you keep dropping that 100 people start sharing and it turns to two three four five six and then just go like a wildfire mm. yeah all you gotta do is uh, consistency, mm. man. If you get a video they ain't doing over, you keep dropping them motherfuckers. Sometimes you just gotta go crazy, bro. On that thing. You see, I call it the truth teller scheme. Truth teller. He the prime example of it. Truth teller gonna drop. Hey, look at this video. 24 hours, he gonna drop five, six videos, bro. And look, you might think that he ain't doing nothing, but if he got a 9,000 video for this video, he got a 7,000 for this, he got five right here. He got six over here. He got seven over there. Nigga, them views, nigga, and money. And then you probably going off the views. You ain't going off the man um, money, what he get per view. It's different levels to it. Like certain people get $20 for every thousand views. You know what I'm talking about? Certain people get $15 for every thousand views. Like people be trying to count people's shit and don't even know how it work. Like it, it worked like that. Like some people got to get thirty thirty dollars every thousand views. I'm pretty sure, like the academics and all them. I'm pretty sure they shitting like two hundred every thousand views, some shit like that. So is it when you say like academics or somebody like that? Do you feel like the more subscribers you have, the more you're gonna get paid per view? No, no, no. It don't even matter about subscribers. I done had got them ten thousand subscribers and made eight thousand dollars on YouTube. In one month. Hell yeah. It don't it don't matter about that shit, bro. It don't it don't matter about how many subscribers you got, bro. So I mean, but is there a way to tell how much you're gonna get paid per per view or it's pretty much like they decide? No, you it keep going up. Like when you first start out, you start at two dollars. Mm -hmm. Two dollars, a dollar, a dollar and a dollar and five cent probably, mm -hmm. or eighty cent. And then you, as you keep going and your shit you know, getting monetized and shit like that, bro. You climb. But I'm, I'm saying um, the highest, the highest I ever got for a video on the live was thirty seven dollars, thirty seven, thirty seven dollars every thousand views, and that was on the live. That's what it was. Uh, I think FBG Cash. I got like fifty k on that motherfucker. That motherfucker was like, yeah, thirty some dollars uh, uh, every thousand views, and that bitch went crazy. Then. On, on, on a regular upload video, um, I did a story time. And that motherfucker got like 100K some views now. And that, that motherfucker like every every thousand views like $25, $26, some shit like that. Damn, bro. <clears throat> it's a, it's a follow-up question that just popped in my head. But I, I, this is what I was asking you. So you're saying the more, the more consistent you become, the more subscribers you receive, the more they notice you in the algorithm. No, nah, you can get subscribers just by dropping shorts. No, this, so this is what I was going to say, though. Um, like, that still doesn't tell you, okay, you're going to receive X, Y, and Z per view. So it's no really, it's no way to really gauge it, though. Like, it just depends on the video, right? No, no, no. There's no guarantee you're going to get it, it, 7, it, 8, 9, 10, No, nah, see, it, yeah, it's a guarantee. If you All keep right, pushing. break that down, bro. So look, say, say you start your YouTube page. You start off with 20 percent, 20, 20 cent every thousand views. You fresh home. Now you dropping videos every day, every other day, every every forty eight hours. That money is turning over and going up. It's either it's going up or your shit is staying the same or it's dropping. Mm. You know what I'm saying? And like every day it's going up. Your money going up, bro. I don't give a fuck if it's about a pennies or about a cents or about a. 25 cents, at, you know what I'm talking about, your shit going up. Watch your analytics. In your YouTube studios, you gotta, you gotta, people gotta start paying attention to all that, that chart with the boys, where the arrows going, niggas gotta start paying attention to that shit, bro. Cause it count, it tell you your audience, when they on there, all that shit, bro. Mm -hmm. Like people gotta dig into that shit. If you wanna be in something, you gotta dig into it, bro. Mm -hmm. That's why I be so, that's why I be mostly successful there. My wife, she an analytics major, mm -hmm. you know, so she, she motherfucking um, cold with the analytics.